Hey guys, what's up? So I'm uh, unboxing here today is the Red Dragon Central Forest Gaming Mouse. Now this was ordered on Amazon UK. It was about 10.98 pounds, so about 11 pounds. And um, yeah, so it's pretty interesting. It's like a very budget gaming mouse. And um, even though it says Red Dragon, it's actually from TechNet. So they've created like a side company. So let's get to the unboxing. So I don't think that's the place where it opens. Oh yeah, wait, let's just go around the box. Um, so you have, it's a 2000 DPI sensor. It's got eight weights right near the back. Uh, it's got six buttons, uh, a backlight, a gold-plated USB, USB connector, a USB 2.0, I think, probably not 3.0, and it's got a braided cable, which is really nice. Uh, so that's just the box there. Some stuff, if you want to pause it right there, you can take a look at that. And then just some more, yeah, USB, blah, blah, blah. Wait, what's that? Yeah, 2.4 gram weights, eight of them. So, yeah, let's take a look at the mouse itself. So, I've got a big knife here because um, I'm leaving to Croatia soon. So, there's my suitcase. Um, like, tonight. And, yeah, so I've packed up that knife. Um, so, let's open this up. There we go. So, you can see it's got some pretty nice packaging, actually. There we go, so this mouse slides out and it's in a giant plastic. Let's see what else they give us here. Um, why operating instructions? That's a lot of instructions. Um, I'll have to take a look at that later. But I don't think it contains too much. It might just be different languages. Yep, Chinese and stuff. But yeah, let's see the mouse. So I think you separate these two. Oop, yeah, there we go. And there's the mouse. So let's just take out the cord. The cord actually looks really nice. You can actually see. The cord, oh, it comes in a nice little Velcro holder, which is pretty nice. Um, oh, and it's permanently attached to the cable, which could get annoying, I suppose. But look at that connector, it's pretty nice. Um, it is gold-plated, as you can see. And the cord feels really nice. It's like this um, string sort of thing. It's really nice. I love this type of cord. And let's see the mouse itself. So it's got, it's quite nice. It's got these, um, uh, actually, it's not rubberized. It's a bit rubberized, but it's um, basically textured plastic. Um, this is just shiny plastic. This is a really nice matte rubberized grip. That actually feels really nice. And it fits. It seems to fit quite well. Um, so you can see the buttons. You have left, right, uh, scroll wheel, click, and scroll. Ooh, that's very smooth. And a DPI switch, and backwards and forwards button. Now this is actually really useful for like first person shooters, I suppose. So if you're a sniper, you can press this. Uh, you know, steady your aim, or you know, something like that. It's not as good as the really professional ones you see, which have uh, lots more control, like changing the DPI itself. Okay, let's see if we can get these weights out. Ooh, wow, that came out easily. So these are the weights here. You can see that. Let's put one out here. So these are the 2.4 gram weights. Uh, it's not that heavy, um, but let's see how it feels without. Oh yeah, without the mouse, it's quite light. Although it is still quite a bit heavy, it's not a particularly light mouse. But yeah, I think I prefer a heavy mouse because you can make more um, specific movements. So I'm going to keep those um, weights in there. But yeah, um, I'll have to bring you guys a review when I get back from Croatia and use this mouse a little bit. Um, but yeah, guys, so that was my unboxing and first look at the Red Dragon Central Forest Gaming Mouse. So yeah, see you guys in the next video.